From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. All right, overnight tonight, I'm Mark J. Weather, by the way, on Instagram and Twitter. We're going to see a spotty rain shower. Most of you dry, just an isolated raindrop or two. Overnight lows, upper 40s and lower 50s by sunrise. Down there in Coshocton, mid 50s for you. Tomorrow near 70 with isolated rain. Danita. Thanks, Mark. Here's a look at today's top stories. Dozens of volunteers answered the call to help bring a missing boy home. Those volunteers joined firefighters and searched six miles of rural Carroll County for 14-year-old Jonathan Menard today. The teen hasn't been seen since Saturday night. Relatives say the boy was picked up by a family friend to do some work on a farm near Carrollton and later taken to a home in New Harrisburg and left alone for a time. And that's when he disappeared. A Marine from Talmadge has captured the hearts of people across the world. Micah Herndon pushed through the intense pain, crawling on his hands and knees after his legs locked up to cross the finish line at the Boston Marathon. Herndon runs with tags on his shoes to remember two comrades and a journalist killed alongside him in Afghanistan. The running has also helped Herndon ease the weight of PTSD. The last Chevy Cruze to ever roll off the line in Lordstown will be auctioned off for charity. The money raised will fund United Way's early education programs in Youngstown and the Mahoney Valley. The Moransky family bought the car last month and they want it to be an important piece of history and also provide a promising future for children in the area. For the latest news and weather, go to News5Cleveland.com or open the News5 app. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.